Welcome back to my channel, my magical friends. I've got another quick unboxing for you. It's an Oracle deck. It's called Earth and Bone. It comes in this sturdy, beautiful box and it's from Rockpool Publishing. There are 42 cards in this deck and it comes with a nice little guidebook. So we're going to take a quick look at that before we get to the cards. It's just the right size, pretty standard for an Oracle deck. And if you like skulls and skeletons, that would be me. This deck is for you. So the contents, pretty standard introduction, how to use the cards, and then you have the interpretations of all the cards. So how to use the cards, how to cleanse them, and then it's got a few quick spreads. Not too many. There are only about three of them, pretty standard ones too. And then you have the interpretation of the cards and you've got a color image and you have an affirmation at the end and the interpretation is a pretty reasonable length all right we're gonna dive right in all right i'm gonna just move that over look at the back of the cards isn't that just gorgeous and look at that the edging gorgeous gorgeous i'm not sure the camera's capturing this properly because even after all this time i still can't do the lighting properly <laughs> but it's gorgeous gorgeous all right let's get right into it okay so the card stock is pretty good it's nice and thick it there is no shine to these cards perhaps a slight little sheen they're not glossy, they're matte, and they're pretty sturdy, and they're, they are very, very easy to shuffle and spread, and I absolutely love that. All right, let's take a look at the cards. So we've got the keyword on top, and then you have a few words at the bottom. Like this one says shelter, and then it has spiritual growth, accountability, and healing. Sage, love this one. Trinity, Apprentice, Warrior, Surrender, Heart, Blood Moon, Visionary, Roots. Now this is one of my least favorite I would say because it's kind of dark and not dark in a sense that it's just a dark card it's dark literally dark and you can't really make out the image that well and I don't know that kind of makes it a little less appealing wayfarer rider crossed Faith, Migration, Uncover, Prosperity, Sorcerer, I love this image, that's really, really nice, Stoicism, Time, Flow, Enchanter, fate and this one too i think could have been a little bit brighter it's just a little too dark and it's just such a nice image beloved burrow the key anything with owls in it really nice cage flight adversary prudence conjurer serpent this is my favorite one in the deck isn't that gorgeous i would love to have a skull just like this maybe not so much with the flowers but definitely with the skull and the snake beast now here's another one that's a little bit too dark could have been a little brighter ascension here's another one specters a little too dark so it's kind of hard to make out the images and when you're doing a spread and you're trying to read and maybe there's dim lighting, it's a little hard to make this out. Owl, love this one too. Shadow, the pack, and this one too, maybe a little too dark. Here's another one, maybe a little bit too dark. Portal, the stand, nest, 
and meadow so all in all this is a really nice deck right up my alley because you know me i love my skull and bones <laughs> So if you're into that kind of stuff, this is definitely the deck for you. And like I said, it's really, really, really easy to shovel. The cards do not stick together. Absolutely fantastic. All right, my friends, I'm going to keep it short and sweet. And there you have it. Earth and Bone Oracle. Thanks so much for being here and watching. And I will see you in the next one. Bye for now.